let us take you through the creation of a construct with a new GeneArt Seamless Plus cloning and assembly kit. This step-by-step -step video will show you how to assemble your construct with ease. The first step before you assemble your DNA fragments is to create your construct in silico and design any primers you might need for introduction of N-terminal homology. The free online GeneArt construct and primer design web tool will walk you through this process. The next step is PCR amplification to introduce N-terminal homology, if it's required for assembly. This kit we are using guarantees assembly of up to four fragments and constructs of up to 40 KB. However, many scientists have had success using the kit to assemble seven fragments and constructs of up to 50 KB. Now you're ready to use the GeneArt Seamless Plus cloning and assembly kit. Depending on the size of your construct, take the appropriate linear vector from the kit. This kit does, however, allow assembly of any vector or creation of your own. Next, add your PCR amplified fragments and linear vector to the tube. Now add the assembly enzyme and incubate at room temperature for 30 minutes. Now that the assembly is complete, it is time to transform the DH10B competent cells provided in the kit and incubate them overnight. The next morning, it's time to pick your colonies. We recommend picking four to five colonies. At this point, if needed, you can perform colony PCR to check your constructs. Now that you have your clone, you can move to the plasmid purification step before transfection. Thank you.